What's your theory about loss now that you're gone or not gone? Well, I'm not gone, yes. Um, I mean, you know, I, I'm not sure what the question is. I'm so sorry. What's the... What's your theory about loss? My theory. Uh, yeah. My theory is, 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 um, is, is what it always has been, which is that it's some sort of um, a place where people who have done bad things <laughs> go to redeem themselves. But I could be wrong. Mm -hmm. it, that's what I've always thought, with, with or without me, mm -hmm. or with me, as, as the case may be. But you can tell us about what happens to Judith. I really can't. I wish I could. Mm -hmm. I wish I could. Some of it you can imagine, and some of it you can't. It's a terrible answer, but it's true. How many episodes will you be left for? I'm not sure, but it's more than one. Yeah. With V, I'm just curious, what do you see as the potential there for the kind of storytelling and character? One of the reasons I chose it is because I don't like to be bored, um, and I and I truly believe that it's almost limitless. Um, you have, you know, for me, you know, woman uh, against the, the, the bad guys kind of thing, which I, I am drawn to, um, but you also have... Um, a lot of interpersonal relationships. I even haven't met on camera half of the actors that I'm working with. So, so truly, you know, you have things that are the way they are now, and then they could go in any different direction, you know, for that. So, I think that the fact that they've made it a character-driven action show is is exciting. I, th I think it's limitless. It's one of the reasons I did it. I, I cannot stand um, when things go into a formula. It starts to make me crazy. I, I like things to be active. I like to be interested. Um, I like things to be sexy. You know, I really I really enjoy that. So so that's that's my answer. I think there is. I think there is a lot. How how is your character different from Juliet? Um, you know, I always say, and, and it's something that I, I didn't even realize until I actually said it, which happens all the time, but Juliet has, you know, the weight of the world on her shoulder. She spent three years basically being tortured. She is someone who is shell-shocked, yet still, you know, crawls, you know, runs, strides through life, continues to push through. Um, and, and I've loved that about her. And, and playing someone who is that broken, yet still walking around, has been an incredible joy for me. Um, what I enjoyed about Erica and, and how it kind of came to be is it's a little bit of the flip side of that. It's, it's someone who is not broken yet. <laughs> that probably will happen. Um, somebody who every single day of her life spends every second trying to protect her world, trying to protect her people, trying to... He puts herself in harm's way. She is very active in, in her life. She's active with her son. She was probably so active in her life that her husband left her. You know, she's not not someone who has made these like crazy, you know, horrible choices. So as a result, it's almost like we get to see someone at the beginning of, of this of this journey, which I like. And and I like the fact that she's tough. I like tough women, but she's outwardly tough. She's an FBI agent. She walks around. You don't want to mess with her. You know what I mean? So, and I like that too. You know, I, I love that Juliet was sneaky, and I like that Eric is out there. You are talking about your character's son. There's a major storyline because he's appealing yes. to the visitor. Yes, um, he's fallen in love with the visitors, um, and who who wouldn't? Do you know they're coming here? They're they're curing diseases. They're they're beautiful. They're peaceful. Do you know what I mean? All of these things that we we crave and we want so much, they're going to just hand to us. You know, anyone you ever loved who who is who is who's died or, or is dying or who is sick, they're going to make all that better. They're going to take away all our pain. So as we of course you would love that and 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 you know the sad thing about that is that it's it's not true there's a horrible price for that and I and I think that that's kind of what makes it fun for me is to think that here is this insignificant woman with a little bit of you know combat training and she's going up against people who have, are far far superior in every way um, intellectually you know their weapons are more superior their technology is more superior you know they probably think faster <laughs> they definitely move faster so you're talking about insignificance up against a greater I think it's neat how do you know the, 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 the original show and what is uh, saved from the, the, the original uh, to this one I don't know what it's going to be I know they're going to try and take the most iconic moments and make sure that they do service to them. That's that's what I've heard. I think that all the moments that we, you know, or I was a teenager went, oh my god, those will probably be in there. Although I've heard that Marina said maybe she won't be eating a guinea pig. <laughs> and I think they said maybe you will. So I'm not sure. And did you know it? Did you watch it? I did. Yeah. I did, yeah. I really loved it. You know, I, I used to sit at night and watch television with my parents. And um, and that was one of the shows that we watched. And, and that's kind of fun for me. I like the idea of teenagers and their parents sitting around watching this. You can have a great debate on, on good versus evil. So did you save some stuff to Last question, guys. We gotta go. 
Um, I, I didn't, I didn't um, really because my role is, is new. Yeah, I mean, we did have a protagonist, but he was a man and he had a son. That's really where the, the only the only thing that's the same. Um, but I, I, I definitely loved that feeling of you will do anything to protect your son. And I believe that was that's what carries over for me. What was your question? Last um, question. What impact do you think the, the relationship with Alan Tudyk having degenerated into what it did in the pilot, what impact will that have in your character? That's part of what I was saying about that, which I love that you asked. It's part of what I'm saying about the deconstruction of the character. Do you know what I mean? I'm, she's starting in a place where, yes, her husband left her. Yes, she does this, but she's still a relatively active person. That's going to rock her. It's going to rock her to some degree. We'll just have to see how she handles it. I mean, I think that the way that it looked like it was set up is that he was the only person she trusted. He was the only person in her life. Everyone else had kind of, you know, gone, and she's still just going for it. And now that he's gone, I, I don't know. It's going to be really interesting. I, she may be angrier. She may be bitter. Maybe not. Bitter, bitter's hard to play. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much.